This video will show you how to add up a set of data uh, in a Google spreadsheet and show the result on screen. It will also show you how you can add it up and just check the result very quickly if you don't actually need to use the calculation. We have here a spreadsheet with some students' test scores. The first column has the name of the student, the second column their score in a test at 20, and the third column is their gender. Uh, we want to look at the test scores of boys and the test scores of girls and compare them. Um, notice that the data has already been sorted, so we've got the genders, the first set of uh, students are boys and the second set of students are girls, so the data has already been sorted into order. We want to put uh, a space somewhere over here to store the results, so we'll just put our headings in, um, boys total, and beneath that, girls total. So this is where we'll put our final scores here and here. We'll do the boys total first, so we'll click on the cell where we want the result to go. Uh, and then there's some built-in formulae in Google Spreadsheets. Um, you can get them under more. Um, yours might be displaying, mine, because of the screen size, has been hidden at the moment. Uh, and it's this strange, rather angular capital E. It's actually a Greek letter, sigma. If we click on that, and what we want is sum, and sum means add them all up. So we'll click on sum, and then we need to select the data we need to add. So I've selected there, you can see the scores for all the boys. Let go, press enter, and there's the boys total. We can do the same for girls, go over here, functions, sum, and now select the girls scores, and hit enter, and there we have the girls totals. So the boys total 1 to 8, the girls total 1 3 5. There's a range of other functions as well we could use. You might have noticed when I clicked on function, uh, sum is the total, average is the mean, count is how many there are, maximum and minimum um, should be fairly obvious, and there's more functions, there's some more sophisticated statistical functions if you want them. One other little feature to show you, if you just select the scores for the girls, you'll notice here down in the right hand corner, bottom right hand corner, it says sum 135, which is the same as the total we got from the formula. And these little arrows, if we click them, we can display other inf interesting information. The average was 15, minimum was 10, maximum was 20, and there are nine numbers in the data. We've got a count and a count of how many numbers. Um, this will only be different if some of the data is letters or words which haven't been included. So, But it, as all our scores here are numbers, these two are the same. So that's how to produce some analysis, basic analysis, in a Google spreadsheet.